Hello, I was going to wind up these honey bot and sadomasochism videos uh, because there's a lot of categories if you go on my Beyond Natural Cure account, the Instagram account, there's a lot on there for you to pick through and familiarize yourself with some of the character disorders and what they look like. But I've been getting such a response, a good response from women. They were hostile to it at first because there's this real lockdown with healing. Like I'm just not just in general healing defense, like I'm not gonna heal, which is sort of normal for everyone. But there's so much shame that's connected with women with healing because of the patriarchy. Women have been blamed and women have been identified for their character disorders as if men don't have any. And not only have we been preyed upon, but we're held to a different standard. And I talk about the higher and lower standards, how they're different for men and women, how we should not as women take the bait and lower our standards like the patriarchy keeps telling us to do as if that's our freedom and liberation through us lying, cheating, and stealing, and doing our bro code handshakes and winks <laughs> for freedom. And that's become their freedom, their game that they played on the justice system and how they get away with all the evil shit that they do. But we are women, we are mothers, and we are connected to a higher level, and we can't forget in Genesis where God said that th between the woman and Satan that there was going to be enmity between the woman and the serpent and vice versa so we can't underestimate what a threat women are to the patriarchy and to humanity itself because we carry life within our wombs and we carry the ability to heal humanity on a higher level because of that because of that gift that was given to us and so we can't discount that and neither should we take their manipulations and their own fears they have about us and their own need to oppress us, exploit us, and enslave us. We should be suspect to any of those things that they are telling us to do. And that's one of them is telling us that as women, we have to have a lower standard because we are held to higher standards than men are. And that's actually not a bad thing. The issue is that the patriarchy bro system is not ethical they don't follow any standards and if they could follow some standards and some ethics and some laws most of our problems would really cease wouldn't it so it's not about us acting like them and getting the rights to commit crimes with impunity so i wanted to touch on that because even though i'm seeing such a good response lately from bringing this truth out to humanity which has been blocked and censored for the last 50 years i was really upset to see this man that i knew online he actually used the term honey bot which is the term i used to call hysteric because women are not comfortable with the word hysteric and he called the virgin mary honey bot i guess he doesn't know what a honey bot is he doesn't know what hysteric is and this post he made it was so offensive because it was like this huge bro explain like he he took my information blocked it out and then threw it in some new age spin like he had some type of amazing enlightenment it was really offensive and not only for me just as a catholic for this dude to call the mother of god a honey bot but this is exactly why women don't want to talk about healing and don't want to be held to the standard of healing because there's this feeling of why do I have to heal they're not healing well we can't wait on for them to heal can we 
Yes, humanity is actually passing away fairly quickly and we don't have a lot of time left. It's gonna be up to us and we need to stop waiting on them. But so telling you that I wanna explain that this is why we have to keep it to ourselves and we have the womb room on my site that you can join and the private no woman is my enemy account on instagram and some private safe spaces where we can talk about this and heal enter into some higher levels for higher standards so i've seen it i know the patriarchy is going to use it because that's exactly what happened with me when I shared my diagnosis with my ex who was domestic violent and also part of his own character structure and neurosis, but he, he used my diagnosis against me. And even after I had made great strides of getting better and had experienced higher levels of healing, he still held me to that and basically it becomes a grave they dig for you a diagnosis can be like that for anybody you don't need somebody else a diagnosis can make you block healing yourself 